Yo, what's up guys? It's Yellowfin and it's time for my three times carbon fiber, three years of playing daily reward top drives pack. Yeah, let's just jump right into it and open it up. And hopefully we can get some at least rewarding stuff for playing this game for three years. Could be really good, could be all ultra rares. It is a three times carbon, which isn't a bad pack. So maybe we can get some good stuff. Let's see, that's card number three. Number four and number five is the DS6, car six, one, two, four, spider, seven, beetle, eight is the ranchero, nine, Alon, and ten, magnum RT. There we go. So we got 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Okay. So as of right now, we are on pace for a regular times three carbon fiber. Maybe we'll get some high jumps though. 44. All right. And let's see if we can get an extra ultra. Rare. And. Nope, 49. All right, so first car could be the make or break. We'll have to see what the first number is. Hopefully, it's a big number. Hopefully, it's not like 50, but let's just see. Three, two, one. 53. All right. I'm pretty sure I've gotten this car from another daily reward pack in the past. That car I already have maxed out, so that's going to be fuse material, but maybe we can get some keepers. Let's see. Car number two. Oh, yes. I will happily take that Dodge Charger RT Scat Pack, also a 64 RQ, but that's also a car I really wanted, so I'll happily take that. Next could be either a 64 Ultra, which I will still happily take, if it's new. If it's not new, then I'll be kind of sad, but, or an Epic, or a Legend. So let's see, in three, two, one. Oh! Okay, that's interesting. Acura RDX, it is a new Epic, so I will at least be keeping it for now. It's, it's very meh. <laughs> And I already have the Acadia Denali maxed out. We'll just add the Magnum and all this rest of this stuff. Alon, I probably should keep. That's Fuse. Um, I don't really need that. So yeah, all the rest of the stuff I will add. But that Charger is really the best car from that pack. That Charger is really good. I will max it out pretty soon. Uh, hopefully pretty soon. I don't know. It depends. I've got lots of other stuff I need to max out too, like the Virage and the... Um, I don't know. I've got just a bunch of projects. RGT is a good one too. But lots of different projects. But that Charger is definitely a very nice one. The Maserati will be Fuse. And then if we go into my Epics, right here is the Acura RDX. So I'll keep it for now because I am keeping pretty much every Epic I get because it could be useful eventually. Eventually for something it could be useful, but pretty interesting pull. If we go to my Acura collection uh, right there, I mean, it's another one checked off the list, 14 of 32, and I've got a good majority of the Epics with the RLX, the TL, and now the RDX. I used to have the MDX, but I fused that away. MDX is considerably, be considerably better than the RDX, but not bad, though. I will take an Epic. Epic is nice, especially for it being a free pack, and that Charger is very nice, so I will happily take that as well, wherever it is, right there. That is a very useful car. As you can see, the Donkervort 4.383. Charger is 4.183. Also, let's just check out Ultra Rares real, real quick. Perf Slow. Yeah, 4.183 is one of the better, higher, and stronger stats. Similar to the C63. C63 has good MRA, though, but it used to be on my wish list. Then I removed it when the new update dropped, and I had to wish list all the Morgans, even though then I didn't even end up making that video. So. It's basically a previously wishlisted car that I'm very happy with. So that'll be ending it for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you like this type of content, make sure to like, subscribe, hit that bell, join the Discord server, link in the description. I'm Yellowfin. Thanks for watching and goodbye.